So here's a look at the colors we're going to be using today. Are you guys ready to paint? I'll see you soon. Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel for my art, Nadine Michelle Art. I'm Nadine. Thank you for being here with me. So today I was just going to do some coasters on these tiles. Um, I got these tiles from Home Depot, I believe. I um, got them a while ago. The box was pretty cheap. It was like, I don't know, $10 or less at the most. So with like the holidays coming and everything like that, I thought it'd be a good idea to make some like coasters and like more like functional art. So that's what we're gonna do. Okay, so these are all just leftover colors. Um, I don't have a lot of these, but I just wanted to use them up rather than just wasting them. So that's the cadmium yellow light hue with some titanium white mix into it by Liquitex Basics. And then this is the Liquitex Basics cadmium orange hue with some white added to get to this shade of orange. And this one, I have a real, real tiny bit of it left. Um, this is the Liquitex Basics Media Magenta. And that's it, there's nothing added to this one. Um, and then all the paints were mixed, two parts pouring medium to one part paint. The pouring medium I use is 75% Flowchal to 25% GAC 800. And then I use, this is a mix. This is a bottle with a mix of mostly water and a little bit of GAC 800. And I use that to thin it out further if I need to do so. And here's the consistency we're working with today. Pretty much like I always do for my flip cups. It leaves a mound, but not a big one, just a regular mound. First, what I already did, and you don't have to do this, but I'm kind of OCD and I don't want the backs to be a mess. So I went ahead and I taped them already on the back. Again, you don't have to do that, but I just do. And then the next thing you really should definitely do is this is rubbing alcohol, um, the 91%. And then I just put it on this towel and I clean these off really good. Make sure there's no hair or dust or anything like that on them. I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do a flip cup. I might wreck it a little, I'm not sure. Um, these are just the small four by four tiles. Tiles for me can actually be harder to paint on because you need such small amount of paint. So we're only gonna use an ounce or less, hopefully. Okay. Um, but yeah, I've always had trouble painting on the tiles in the past because it's like so small <laughs> but we're gonna try i'm just using leftover colors anyway so worst case scenario i throw it out or i scrape it and use it as a base coat somewhere else along the way so yeah so i'm gonna use a white base coat okay just gonna put our base coat on first it's such a small surface area i mean it doesn't matter <laughs> so be careful you're needing to pour some on here. I'm getting the edges right now. Make sure all the edges are covered so the paint flows all the way all over our tile here. Okay. And now we're going to layer our cup. Let me use a little bit of this. And then I think I'm going to do 
do just a layered cup. Okay, we're gonna do the orange. Now the yellow. Now just a little magenta, we have to preserve this because I don't have a lot of this color. Okay, now I'm going to flip it over like I would with a normal flip cup, okay? Okay, so I have to be careful because actually things that are smaller are harder for me to paint on. Okay, so one, two, and okay, we got it. It's good. <laughs> a little bit worried. I'm not sure when I get cells or what I didn't use a metallic, but we'll see. This is just to use up extra paints. Okay, so since we don't have a pen or anything, we have to let this sit for a minute so all the paints can come down to the bottom of the cup. Okay. One, two. And definitely use too much paint. Well, it's okay. It looks pretty though. All right, so we're gonna lift this and give it a little more movement. It's been the I don't wanna do it too much because I kinda like some of that. All right, so we have to torch this just like you would a normal painting. You do everything the same, except it's just on a very small surface area, okay? Okay, and then I'm gonna tilt this out. Okay, I'm gonna go up to this top corner first. And back to our center. Go down to this bottom corner. Okay, back to our center again. And then we're gonna go up to the last corner here. Okay, not a ton of cells, but I like it still. It's cute. I'm gonna touch up our edges here. I really like it. Um, at the end, I will go and do a close up and show you all of them, but I wanna take my cameras down and eat for everyone. So, yeah, here's the first one. It's pretty, you know, and you're just using up extra colors, so you might as well, you know. So, that's what I think. All right, that's our first one. I'm gonna torch it real quick. I won't put every single coaster like full like length in here and probably speed some of this up just FYI so you guys don't want to sit through the same thing like four times so yeah so we're gonna do the same thing on this one we're gonna put our base coat down which actually it's a little bit thick and I might set it down a wee bit this was meant for something else originally and then what I was gonna do my paint got all dried up, so yeah, <laughs> kind of have to improvise, but that's okay. A little bit more, should be good. I'm gonna put on our base coat here. And then we're going 
do the same thing. We're gonna flip it onto our tile here. Okay, it's all about the wrist. That's how you don't spill it. You like hold your elbow against your side here or your rib cage, and then you hold the cup like so, and then you just use your wrist to flip it. Okay, so one, two, and three. Okay, here we go. I'm gonna go this way. just how you know it can be so different okay here we go it's been the worst of years the hardest that it's ever been i've screamed for ever since now i'm trying to find my feet again flipping it over like it just takes practice to not like be scared when you're doing it that you're gonna get pain everywhere but even like being as like messy as I am I've never gotten it to where it's gone everywhere you have to practice and just like use your wrist not your whole arm because then it'll go everywhere so yeah I just you want to use your wrist and flip it like so not your whole arm because then that's that's how you're gonna get it everywhere <laughs> it's pretty all right we're gonna wreck it with the lip of our cup here okay so you couldn't tell i love to wreck it with the lip of the cup but only the lip of the cup that's the only way i'll wreck things I don't like like how it looks with like the chopsticks and stuff. I don't know. I just don't really like it. It's just me. It's been the worst of years. I don't even know where to begin. Two fights I've lost. Every single shot I've taken a So here these are. I really, really like how these came out, actually. They're all different, but I like that about them. Um, let me know what you guys think about these. Put it in the comments. If you have any questions, you can put those there. And I will see you next time on Nadine Michelle Art. Bye.